In the first billion years after the Big Bang, the universe was young, chaotic, bright, and full of secrets. Now, the James Webb Space Telescope has peered back in time to reveal something no one expected. Two distant quasars, J2223632 and J5 Quasi442, each powered by a supermassive black hole, already existed 12.9 billion years ago. Their galaxies were huge, up to 60 billion solar masses, even though the cosmos was still a child. That's a problem. Because according to theory, black holes this massive should stop their galaxies from growing, choking off star formation in what's called galactic quenching. But here's the twist. These dying galaxies are still alive, and their black holes are still feeding. Webb AS infrared eyes showed that galaxies and black holes were already co-evolving, locked in a feedback loop that built the structure of the modern universe. It S as if the cosmos learned to grow too fast, for reasons we still don't fully understand. Researchers say these early quasars could hold clues to even deeper mysteries, from dark matter to dark energy, and how galaxies, like ours, became what they are today. The early universe wasn't quiet. It was already writing the story of everything we see now.